Hello everyone, it's Grethorn from Grethorn's Games and I am running the free to play champion. Now I've just picked up the finished the brigands and the spider slayer deeds. I'm still on my way to level 20. Now I'm level 14 at the moment. Now my inventory is full. Uh, I picked up a, a nice two-handed weapon a nice second weapon in actual fact so and I've got a whole heap of things that are now just sitting in my pending loot it's just an overflow but I'm now so I've done the spiders and I've done the brigands and I am up to Nika brickers and flies so Nika brickers are on the list and sickle flies are on the list so I'll, I'll just pick up something so I'm going to avoid the spiders there's some nicker breakers and I'm just gradually heading south in actual fact just heading the character south There's some more Nika Breakers. There's a whole patch of Nika Breakers just sitting here. So I'll take these out. I'll again do the rend. And then move on to another one. Do another rend. Move on to a something that's actually a Nika Breaker. Do another rend. Move on to another one. Do an AOE. And when rend comes back up, I'll pick up rend. Pick up another one. Rend. There's another one. Tab selected. And there we go. So I'll just pick those ones up. And just tidy this all up. And I'll continue moving south. Oh, there's another Nika Breaker over there. You get to like, you, you get to see them. I mean, they're red on the map, but you, you get to, you get the idea of where they are. Just... Okay, it's got Rend on. I don't want the spider. Run away from the spider, because I've already got them. I mean, you could get them for leveling purposes, but I don't really need them, so I don't really want them. Spider's probably going up. Oh, spider ran away. They have a distance. There's another Nika Breaker. Let's tab target it, rend it, and keep going. More Nika Breaker. There's another Nika Breaker. Rend it. I've probably accumulated enough by now to actually start. If the rend didn't go off. You could see that the rend wasn't on it. But, okay, keep going. Another Nika Breaker. I'm, I'm, I'm supposed to be heading south, but this is where they, this is where they currently are. There's another one. As long as the rend is on, that's fine. As long as I don't run too far away from its original spawn spot, that'll be fine. So the wren should take care of that. They do jump into the ground. That's okay. Okay, so let's keep going south. See if I can pick some more up. So there's... There were a lot of... There are a lot of spiders in the centre of this area. I'm going to avoid that. But if you wanted, to, if you hadn't picked up the Slayer deeds for spiders by this stage, Oops. Rends up. Okay, good. Let's move to another one. Bring rend up. It's got rend. Move to another one. 
do some AOE until the rend's up. Do rend, move to another one. Might have to do a bit of actual fighting here for a second. Some AOE attacks. Now, I've, added, I've actually got a new ability, Bracing Attack, which does a heal. Which happens from getting to level 14, Bracing Attack, which recovers a lot of morale. And I'm going to push it right up here, because... Rends up. I said I'm supposed to be heading south. Rends up. They're respawning so quickly around here that I don't actually mind picking them up. Okay, keep heading south. Because I would like to get to the sickle flies. Rends up. Head south, okay, so I will head south now, just uh, if I get out of my way I will pick some of them up, but otherwise I'll just keep heading south, because as I said I do want to pick up the sickle flies, here's another Nika Breaker, it'll do. Keep heading south. Another Nika Breaker. Keep heading south, another Nika Breaker. There's so many Nika Breakers around here. So, map is, okay, so I'm heading south towards here. I don't want any of the goblins. There's lots of quests around this, around this area. And, uh, again, you can, you can be directed straight into, into all of these. After you've done all the quests in, in a zone, sometimes, especially with the starter areas, it's nice to pick up the, nice to pick up, pick up the Slayer Deeds. But now that I've got bracing attack, oh, there we have us, the, the first of the sickle flies. You actually, you, you can, you, you end up recognizing them um, fairly, fairly easily. And I'll show you where they are, the, the main place where they're located. Okay, there's the sickle fly up. And Nika Briggers, they're, they're a dime a dozen in the, in the marsh waters, midwater marsh. So I'll, I'll just keep picking them up while I go and head to the beginning of the the route for the sickle flies. And these are all reasonably on level, so it's it's nice to pick them up. Okay, Ren's on that one, it will disappear. Heading south, okay, that's the normal Mika Brika done. Lock that in, actually, and I'll lock that in. Um, I might as well remove the Explorer and move the Deeds, Scouting, yep. I don't really need that one as well, but I'll head, keep heading south. Okay, so let's pick up the rest of the Nika Breakers on the way. Now, what you may or may not have noticed is that I've actually run almost directly south, well, more or less south. And you'll find that the sickle flies are along the southern edge of the Midgewater Marshes. That's the easiest way to pick them up. If you tab target, you can find them relatively easily. Um, you can see that we're starting to get more of them as we get here. Another sickle fly, tab targeted to get, to pick it up. Double click to close on it. 
Go through the routine. And pick up the next burrower, Nika Breaker. And you see the Nika Breakers. There's, there's far less sickle flies than there are Nika Breakers, but as long as you travel in the right locations, as in along the southern edge of this, of the Midgewater Marshes, you will pick up far more of the sickle flies. They're nice level, they're level 14, you can see we're starting to get more and more of them. Tab targeting, picked it up, and they're slightly higher level than the Midgewater Marshes, uh, the Nick Breakers, I should say. But I still have some Nicker Breakers to pick up. Now, I, I'm actually going to go there. There's another one over there on the left. So let's go and pick it up right, while I'm here. I'm on my way to the next sickle fly. As long as the wren's up, you should be fine. That up, and I've got the sickle fly here. Okay, so I've got the bracing attack to defend myself if I get in trouble, which I will use. And it's filled my morale back up again, as you've noticed. It's a nice little, nice little skill. Another sickle fly. In fact, you can see another one behind it. But you can see that this is this is fairly straightforward. will gradually make my way along the edge. There's another one there. This gives you so much, it, it's so much easier to pick up the sickle flies if you just run up and back. Now I'm actually going to make my way to the Lone Lands stable point as a, as a yeah, pick up sickle fly. And I actually have, I think, Okay, let's see if I've got any more flies up here on the hill. No, nothing. Oh, oh, there's one there. As I said, you get used to it. There it is. The sickle fly, as I said, they're, they're hard to find unless you actually know where to look. Okay, and we will keep going. Don't need the sapper. I actually won't bother with the sickle with the uh, Nika breakers at this point because they're not they're not my priority. I'll pick them up. So you can see we've I've got I've got two of the sickle flies just sitting there on the way through, pick them up, keep going. If you get bored with the sickle flies, then you just pick the others up. Okay, that's gone. Let's pick another sickle fly up. Just scan for some more. Yeah, there's another one right along this edge, as you can see. It's, as I said, once you, once you know where they are, they're, they're hard to miss. Okay. And tab targeting will give me anything, maybe. Just tabbing, just to find what's around. These are all these water sappers, I don't want them. Yep, more sappers, more warriors. I mean, if you really want to pick up quests, uh, pick up experience, then, you know, they're there, but Nika Breakers, don't worry about the Nika Breakers. Looks like I'm going to get all the way to the Lone Lands, which is a level jump, so you have to be careful. Suddenly, suddenly all your creatures, instead of being teal, they're going to start turning There's another sickle fly while I'm here. 
So instead of being yellow and orange, you can see that suddenly they've started turning, they've actually turned purple, which means they're level 23, they're nine levels higher than I am. So it actually becomes quite dangerous to, to fight them. But if you turn around, you should be able to head back and pick up more of them. Now I, I will pick up the Slayer Deeds on, on the way between this video and the next, but what I actually wanted to do is go up to Lone Lands and pick up the stable. I don't really need the quests here yet, it's, it's still, I'm, I'm far too low level to be able to do that, but see I've got lottery points for, for doing the Nika Brika normal deeds. I've still got multiples of these to go. Um, and there are other, so and I'll get to those. Just, just give me a second. Go to the stable point and get the. So this is the Forsaken Inn. You will get evicted to the Forsaken Inn at some point. Um, but the quests in this area are too high a level for for this character, level fourteen. How okay, can I be of so service? I can't actually do any any of those at this point, but I wanted to get the stable point. I will actually use the milestone to go back. Actually, while I'm here, I'll, I'll go into the Forsaken Inn and I'll actually sell all the stuff that I've got, that I've accumulated. Again, there'll be a heavy armor gear, heavy, heavy armor person, and, and all sorts of other things. But the, the heavy armor what is going to be need? is going to be level twenty three and level twenty. So it's it's still too far. I'll repair all my gear, which is always good to do occasionally. But what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to would you need something today? Sell what looks like basically everything that I've got. Scroll down, that's the great sword that I was using, which I got a one-handed weapon that was better than it, just as a drop. The gloves, no, they're not as good. Okay, I can sell all. It's gonna warn me, but yeah, that's okay. Now I'll get all of the loot, all of the stuff that was sitting in my pending, and I can sell all of that as well. So I'm almost up to a gold, which is nice, but, these quests are all silver, they're all too high for me. You can see that there is a quest there, but I can't actually get the quest because this area is just too just too big for me. Greetings. Um, while I'm here, just because the, saw, the weapon is the most important thing. Can I use a great axe? Yes, I can. Level 21. Level 15, oh, I want the, I'll grab the level 21 axe. Oh, actually I'll grab the level 18 one. Okay. So I'm going to lock that in as well. So I've, I've got a couple of options with two-handed weapons when, when I get high enough level. Okay, so I'm going to milestone back. Because that's what you do. When you're in an area and you want to get back to somewhere near home. So take me to back to the middle of Bree. And I'm going to actually run down to South Bree just to pick up the stable point there so I'll come down to South Bree and I'll actually set the milestone down at South Bree while I'm at it. So yeah so so let's see if there's let's see if I've got any more points to put in. I do. Now at this point I'm I seem to have enough uh, battle frenzy. I seem to have enough rage. 
I might actually put some extra points into either blade wall damage or just pump the raging blade damage. Raging blade is, is really quite useful. And I'll just keep I'll just keep pushing into the yellow line. I haven't got any abilities yet. I'll get net ten percent out of combat run speed from being a high elf uh, in level seventeen, I think it is. Um, but you, I will eventually start putting those there, the, the racial deeds, in that spot, in those spots. They will gradually unlock. And as you can see, I'm, I'm gradually earning more and more of these. Okay, here's the South Bree Stable. What can I do for you? Okay, so I could go to Coombe from here, but I'm not going to. But almost everything else... The Forsaken Inn I can travel to now because I had that stable point but pretty much everything else on my list is unavailable to me but I do have the South South Bree stable point and out here is the skirmish camp which I'll be, I'll be parking myself in these but it won't, won't be relevant till level 20 but I'll be parking myself around the skirmish camps when the time comes. Now there are some Nika Breakers out here as well. I'll probably end up picking them up, picking those up here as well. They're level 16, that's good. But thank you for watching. As I said, I will finish the sickle flies and finish the Nika Breakers in those two locations. And, and actually, as I said, around here there's more Nika Breakers. Um, but yeah, I'll run across here for the sickle flies back and forwards a couple of times until I finish that out. And uh, then I will catch you in the next video. Hopefully by that stage I'll be level 15. Okay, everyone. Thank you for watching. Catch you next time. Bye.